today I'm going to be showing you the MTEX to multi-leader Lisp routine. I uh, found this Lisp routine years ago on the AutoCAD Tips blog, and I've just not posted it because I, I used it for myself, but I've had several people ask me this week, is it possible to convert MTEX to a multi-leader after it's laid out? And the answer is, uh, natively within AutoCAD, it cannot be done, but there is a Lisp routine that can handle this. Um, so I give credit to the AutoCAD Tips blog because I did not do this myself. But here it is in action. So this is just regular mText, as you can see. Nothing fancy. Okay, and this can only be done with mText, not regular single line text. Okay, so um, I'm going to load... I'm going to go ahead and load the list routine. Now, normally, if I'm using a list routine on a regular basis, I am going to load it into my uh, startup suite so I don't have to go through and manually find it in my folders and load it. So there's the M2, MT2ML list routine. And I believe I already have it loaded, so I'm not going to see the warning that says, hey, this is not a, you know, created by a trusted advisor or a trusted user or. Uh, trusted source so uh, if it did uh, just giving you a warning do you want to load it anyway um, I've already loaded it so there it is it's loaded successfully and I'm gonna close it <clears throat> so all you have to do is type in the command MT 2 ML and hit enter and basically follow the prompts at the command line so select your source text that's where I want it uh, where do you want your arrowhead to be? I'll put the arrowhead down here and then go ahead and specify the landing location. I'll drop it right there and when I hit enter it converts the text to a multi-leader which now I can go to my multi-leader and I can add more leaders to this and come out and, and so on and so on if need be. So I hope you find this interesting. I hope you find it useful. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, post the list routine that I used right here in the blog for you to go ahead and reuse it. All right. Thank you.